Welcome to Work Smarter TV. I am Martin, and in this video, I will show you how to delete cells, rows, and columns. We'll start with rows and columns. The easiest way is to just select them first, click on <laughs> let's delete Greece from the European Union. Yeah, this is a, sorry, this is entirely accidental, but um, some subconsciously maybe not. <laughs> All right, um, you select it by clicking with your left mouse button and you can say, okay, um, you can either select it with the right mouse button and click delete. What you can also do is uh, go select it first and then go to delete and say delete cells. And there you go. Same goes for rows. Let's delete the year 2003. And I can also just I click the delete button. But as you can see, what happens now is that the, the column stays, but the cells get emptied. Undo. And we can say delete cells and it will go here as well. Ah, and this Excel says you're breaking a formula. Be careful. Yeah. Um, but you can also say I want these cells deleted. And there's two ways to delete cells. If you use this uh, uh, this dialog, it will say, okay, I not only want to remove the values from the cells, but I also want to make the cells disappear themselves and that means that um, Excel wants to fill up these cells because they there can be a gap in a workbook they have to be cells and yeah it, we're breaking uh, formulas again um, and as you can see this data block has now shifted now that which is kind of dangerous because you haven't removed uh, uh, the data for Germany 2004, but you've simply moved the data from for um, Germany 2009 to 2004. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sorry about this, guys. But what you can also do is you can say, I want to clear contents. And if you select uh, arrange, and if you hit the delete key on your keyboard, that's what will happen. And most of the time, that's what you want to do. Um, and if we go here, uh, that's where you delete the uh, cells, as you can see. And you can even delete an entire sheet, which you could also do by clicking this one. Now, um, this is basically it, but it's something always when you're moving around large blocks of data or you're deleting cells, deleting columns, always be wary, be wary, be wary of the consequences and uh, what happens to the rest of your data. All right, I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions, you can leave them in the comments. You can also subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking the button above this video. And if you click on the button in the bottom right corner, uh, you go to my website, worksmarter.tv, um, and you can subscribe to my mailing list there to get updates when I post new videos. And also you get tips and tricks on how, how to use Excel in a smarter way. Thank you for watching. Hope to see you next time and bye bye.